Hello everyone! Welcome to another Royal High video. Today I'm gonna show the new Halloween update and I am so excited for this because I love Halloween and Royal High always makes such great updates. So yeah, I'm really excited to show you guys this update. It's been a long time since there was an update in Royal High so finally we have a huge update and I don't think this update is completed yet. I think the battle royal place is gonna get a makeover because I heard about that getting a makeover so we still have that coming but anyways let's just get straight into the video. So as you guys probably noticed Autumn Town is back and that is just amazing! I love Autumn Town, it's so cool, but I don't really have a lot of things to do here because I got everything last year, but there's a new set I really want to show, and also there's a maze that I'm going to show as well. I only have two candies, and that's fine, but if you guys remember the cars from last year, they were pretty glitchy, so let's see if... oh. Okay, what was that? I don't know. But let's see if they're glitching anymore. And I'm stuck. Okay. Let's spawn another card in here. So I really want to test out if these are glitchy or if they're fixed. Okay, these cars are actually not that bad. I think they fixed it or did something to these. And I keep bumping. I'm a very good driver. <laughs> but... If you guys remember, there was a lot of accessories that you would get if you would go trick-or-treating. So those accessories are actually reworked and I'm wearing one of them. So I want to show that and oh, what was that? Flip right there. <laughs> Let's go up here because the maze is here. So I want to show that and I'm very slow. Can I even go? Go, go, go. Yay, almost didn't make it. So, I'm gonna drive right there, where the maze is at. Um, I, I kind of fell. Oh no, my car! No! What is going on? Okay. Well, my car is gonna be there then. And... So, here we are at the super hard maze, and... This already says that this maze is insanely hard, you won't beat it. I already tried this maze and it's actually not that hard. This year's maze is so much more detailed if you compare the two from last year. And this year's, I would probably pick this one here if you guys remember the last year's one. It was pretty boring, but I already found some chests, so I'm just gonna show some of them. If you guys remember the candy hunt from last year, then you'll remember these um, accessories that you get. As you guys probably noticed, this maze is huge, like huge. So make sure to just do this in peace, and you can maybe do this with your friend or someone, so it's not that boring to just do it alone, or just go to a public server and do it with the people in the server. Because I think that's a lot of fun, to do it with people rather than alone. Ooh, look at that neon spider right there, it's so cool. I love how they added like so many details into this, like look at that huge spider right there. It's just glowing, it's really cool. And then there's this thing here, and yeah. I'm gonna try to find the the ending or when you get the badge so I think I know where it is okay guys finally after like two hours of trying to get in I got in finally so here we are and this is what this place looks like it has pretty cool decorations and on the wall here it says congratulations you've won run your body into here to get out of here so this is a pretty cool thing but i'm warning you guys this maze is like impossible literally impossible i'm not kidding it, it is so hard but i already got the badge so it says escaped the maze 2020 
so let's go to my profile here and here so this is what it says and there was a similar one last year but it was super hard now it's extremely hard so that's pretty cool i don't know why i didn't get the badge the halloween 2020 badge when you come into this game i'm like really confused why i didn't get that i'm gonna try to figure out why i can't get it but i don't think i'm the only one experiencing this because when i looked at people's profiles they didn't have it either but i'm not gonna talk here and not get this huge whatever this is let's open it look i can just go in it <laughs> oh okay we got nightmare witch hat and 5000 diamonds so actually i already have the nightmare witch hat but 5000 diamonds whoa like i know the set costs like 100000 so i'm going to go under 2 million which is pretty sad but it's okay so let's just get out of here Whew, okay we got out and there's so many chests in that maze so yeah make sure to get every single one if you want a lot of diamonds and accessories so i'm gonna give away some of these ones that i got because i got a lot of the duplicate ones so i'm gonna give them away probably because i don't need two of them <laughs> but now it's time to look at the sets so when you go to the shop this is what it looks like and so it says october exclusives we have the shadow emperor set that is back in the shop and we have a new set which is called royal rebel 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 i guess and we have a candy store halloween wings and treasure chest collectibles and these are the ones that you get from the chests i guess and as you can see i have every one of these and this is probably my favorite one in the candy store we have all of these new reworked accessories and i love how this broom costs 100,000 candies i know no one's gonna try to get this or maybe there are but it just costs so much it's gonna take so long and yeah let's just look at the set here so these cost i'm not sure how much these cost together but around a hundred thousand so i'm gonna start off with the most expensive things so these ones mm, let's start off with the boots let's get these okay royal rebel laced boots there we go look at my diamonds oh no i don't have enough all right I, I do but let's just go for it i don't care anymore i'm gonna get my diamonds back it's gonna be okay it doesn't take long for me to get my diamonds back look at my diamonds no my diamonds i, I don't want to buy these i'm literally gonna have to like farm fifty thousand diamonds and that's a lot of diamonds so i'm just gonna stop right here and look at the ones that i got so then i'm gonna farm and get the other ones so <laughs> yeah that's what i'm gonna do so here are the sleeves and i like how there's nails on it and i like the detailing it's pretty detailed but this ring is just like floating in the air which is kind of sad then we got the boots these are really cool i like the lace on the top and then the buttons and the ribbon and it's just really cool and you can make really cool outfits with these accessories thank you bubbles and now i can get more diamonds as well but let's continue and look at the skirt so it has a lot of laces and it goes really nicely in the back just like this and yeah i really like this skirt this is amazing this looks amazing so i'm for sure gonna use this a lot so we still have the royal rebel spiked 
veil i don't know if i want to buy these right now and we have the corset as well but i'm gonna end up buying these though so if there's gonna be another part of this update or some more like things that come to this update i'm probably gonna do a video about it and yeah so let's hope i get my diamonds back because that hurt to watch just look at my diamonds die but it's okay if i don't have the bodice because i guess this looks good with the valentina one though so it's all right i'll end up buying the whole set though but i'll just have to get some diamonds so i don't go that much under also i have one more thing i wanna see so currently i'm not in a private server but let's look at the cord on the cob and some of these and i know i'm losing diamonds it's okay it's just three diamonds i can get that back in a second so it doesn't matter but here's the caramel apple and the cord on the cob so let's go somewhere okay i'm currently on a roof but it's okay let's just look at these so we have the caramel apple and i think this is kind of reworked or is it just me who thinks it looks different okay now for the tasting test let's see mm, yeah it's pretty good yeah I, I i really don't know what it tastes like but let's just pretend that i know what it tastes like and now we got the corn on the cob it looks so cool <laughs> i love the little butter on top of it let's see if this tastes better oh yeah just put it on your eyes just like normally you would <laughs> yeah pretty pretty good even it's not going on my mouth but yeah i like how they reworked a lot of stuff so that they look cooler i guess or better so yeah that was pretty nice and i bet all of the other foods are probably reworked as well and also here's some things i forgot to show so as i was talking about the old accessories they got reworked so i'm gonna show them right now because i didn't so let's start off with the knife so if you guys remember the knife was kind of like bad it didn't look that nice or interesting last time so now we have a much more detailed knife and now it actually looks like a kitchen knife and i like how you can change the color so it's really cool i really like it next we have the witch hat and they didn't really do anything to this that much but it still looks really cool i guess they changed it a little bit so it looks cooler and will look more detailed and there's some people flying back there but let's just ignore those for the next accessory i have to take off my skirt so goodbye skirt because we're gonna take a look at the kitty purse and if i'm being honest i liked the older one better because it just looked nicer i guess but this is just more detailed and looks more cooler i guess and yeah but overall it's not that bad actually i like it but i would prefer the older one over this one now it's time for my favorite accessory so they are the kitty ears so i really like how these look the shape is different and they just look much nicer and i really like these ears so i'm gonna be using these a lot in my outfits so you'll be seeing me wear these a lot and also the spider earring got reworked so they have a spider web right there and i think they're a bit bigger yeah so i like what they did to that these look so much better and i like how they reworked the older accessories so let's hope they're gonna keep doing that and also i noticed a thing about the new accessories so 
if we put the skirt, let's just put it on. So if you press your character here, you can see mix match and detach bustle. So it takes off that thing right there. And that's such a cool thing. And I love how they did that. And then for the boots, they did a mix match. So that looks really cool. And also you would get this little candy pot thing when you come to the game. So you will get this into your inventory. And there was a similar one last year as well. And this is a pretty cool one. I like this one better because <laughs> I like the candy better. It looks just nicer. And why am I holding a square? I don't know what that is. Okay, that's weird. But yeah, I really like this update and I think this was all. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And also don't forget to leave a comment down below on what Royal High videos you want to see. I have a pretty good video idea planned. I might do a roleplay, a Halloween roleplay themed video. So that's going to be a lot of fun if I will make that. So yeah, I just want to try out like roleplays because I think they seem like a lot of fun and probably fun to record. I'll try to make a roleplay if I can sometime, so we'll see how that goes. But anyways, I will see you in the next video. Bye!